Hi guys, recently I did an assembly build video for this clock kit and I sort of soldered that together and it all went together quite nicely. And in that video I, I explained that I didn't realise that a separate item was this Perspex enclosure. So I've ordered that after the fact. It's just arrived today. So I thought we'd go through this and put it together and uh, I'll show you that now. So I'll just move this out of the way for a second. Um, inside the kit here, this is just laser cut perspex by the looks of it, or acrylic plastic. Um, we've got a front and back and our four sides, it's all pretty standard stuff here. And they gave us some extra nylon mounting hardware, so I'll just move that aside. Now I've got to peel all of this, so it looks like this is the back panel, because they give us uh, access to these two um, push buttons, which you can see are on the back there. And also the USB down here. Um, and oh, that must be for the buzzer, so it actually goes this way around. So I'll peel this um, protective layer off now. Okay, this is the last piece here, um, so it all came off nice and neatly. The plastic's in perfect condition, um, obviously it's got all the protective film on it. Um, I thought I'd just have a quick look and see um, how thick this is. 2.85 millimeters, or for the uh, Imperials, there's 0.112 inches. Um, so yeah, it's nice and thick, nice and strong. Um, now there's no instructions for this thing. Uh, but my guess is we uh, take these these existing feet here off first and then we just basically put it together. There's only a few pieces here. It's not going to be too difficult. Um, yeah, so it looks like we uh, we got these little standoffs. Um, I'll see if I can get you to focus on that. So they gave us these sort of looking pieces here. Um, we've got four of them, and I think the way this is supposed to work, because we've got this big display here that sort of sits off the board quite a distance, I think we would have to offset the front panel here, I imagine. Um, hmm. <laughs> so we might have to use all of these pieces. Like that, maybe. I'll put one over this opposite corner so we can test it out quickly before I do the whole lot. Just want to sort of see. So that does fit there nicely. And this piece, maybe you can see this, it's all clear plastic, but so that looks like it will fit like that as well once I get those pieces in. Um, it's sort of sitting on top of that PZA buzzer there, but that, that should be fine. And obviously the sides just go in between them. So I'll put these other two corners in and then we're basically done. Um, now the main benefit of having the case like this is obviously it looks a lot nicer but it um, really for me I, I just think it's going to help a lot with the dust situation like I don't like um, having electronic boards just laying around on my bench and things I try and put them in boxes or in enclosures or um, that sort of stuff just so they don't get too dusty over time and something like this where it's all through hole and it's pretty intricate it's um, it could be a pain to dust so this will make it a lot easier. Alrighty, so I think what I'll do is I'll put that in first and I'll drop all these side pieces in. I'm assuming they're all exactly the same. Okay, now this goes on the back. And then these little hex nuts here will just screw in on both sides. So I've got to put one on that side and then one on this side and do that for all four corners and then that will sandwich the whole assembly together. And it's lucky that I didn't throw any of my little spare parts away because I do actually need those two nylon nuts here as well, the leftovers. So they're the two last bits there to go in.
just like that. So that's it. That's its little plastic enclosure. It looks nice and neat. Um, so we've got the USB port is still accessible here at the back. You can see that's on now. I'll kill the light. So there it is, very neat and tidy. Um, it sits upright now on the desk. Um, so the, the kit itself was $15 Australian. The case was $8 Australian. And that's uh, free shipping deal extreme. So you can find the links below. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with this little kit. Um, it's nice and neat. Thanks again guys for watching and see you in another video.